It's common during Wyoming's growing season that somebody has some raspberry plants that they're willing to get rid of or just trying to get off their hands. Now, if you're one of those lucky people that inherits some raspberry plants, there's a few things you might want to consider. You need to consider that wherever those raspberries are coming from, once they're transplanted to your garden or new area, they'll be bringing with them any soil or disease issues that are currently happening where their home range is. So if you have a bed and you bring in some new plants, please be aware that you might be introducing something that could potentially be a problem. One of the other issues that can happen when transplanting raspberries is not knowing what you have for transplants. We have two types of raspberries that we're concerned with. The first being raspberries that are primocanes, meaning they produce fruit on the first year's cane. This would be a cane. The other variety is a floricane, meaning they produce fruit on a two-year-old cane. Now, depending on whether it's a primocane or a floricane, we're gonna have different management practices that need to take place. It's a good idea to figure out what varieties you might have from the previous owners of the plants. For more questions on growing raspberries in Wyoming, contact your local University of Wyoming Extension office. From the University of Wyoming Extension, I'm Brian Sebade, and you're watching From the Ground Up.